So On One Software has released the latest update for Photo Raw. We look at what's changed. So update 2017.0.2 has been released and there's a lot more that On One has been doing in the background including add new features, over 200 bug fixes, but let's first look at the additions to the software. Improved highlight recovery. This is the area of concern for me and improvements have been marginal and in quick testing have done with Lightroom it shows that Amon Raw still has the ugly shading around the burnt areas um, of the image. Now it's under extreme testing I accept. Uh, this image is an example. Now the normal recovery I feel it's acceptable but when pushed this banding is there more improvements must be made. It's about the same quantity of recovery as Lightroom. And here's where it works, where the image is not too burnt out. So we, we can recover some of the highlights. And in these areas where normal photographs, it's perfectly acceptable. Now, things that have been added is some support for the Fuji cameras and some of the processes to do with Fuji. There's over 200 bug fixes, which is great news. Uh, these include 20 improvements to browser performance. It, it was quick anyway, so it's impressive that they're trying to make it faster. Now, there's also a lot of uh, overall updates. So, brush fixes. Uh, there's, there was issues with them on the Intel video cards. That seems to have been repaired. And added support for Olympus, some of the Pentax, Nikon, Panasonic, etc. I'll list them here so it's easy for you to see. And there's also, I've come across some issues with Perfect Eraser and the Retouch Brush. And it was missing when you were actually highlighting areas to be repaired. They seem to have repaired this now as well. Now, when you use the presets, sometimes they didn't appear correctly. And it took me to restart on one to make it work. Well, they seem to have fixed this as well now. There's also some areas where when you were adjusting the angle of the photograph, uh, the level, it would jump about a bit and you get an unexpected angle. That's been repaired. Um, and they've done things like uh, optimize the sidecar file size, which again is great news for photographers who are using this system a lot. But there's still plenty to come, guys. I'm one of promising lots, lots more and they do have this schedule where they're going to be releasing it through the year and making this tool better and better. I for one, I'm loving it. I think it's a great piece of software and these improvements are going a long way to allowing me to use it in my day-to-day -day work. Well, it's a bit of an underwhelming update. Um, no new tools, but 200 bug fixes is moving the product forward and making it a viable alternative to Lightroom. So they are working hard, it's obvious with 200 bug fixes, but there's nothing new that we can play with. So this video was just a quick one guys, just to let you know what's happening with On1. Uh, I'll see you in the next video. So if you liked this video, or it was any help to you, please like, comment and subscribe.